Hi there, welcome to my final video on emitted variable bias. And let's say in this video we were interested in whether there were geographical differences in an individual's IQ score. So this is a particularly controversial area in social sciences. And let's say we created some variable Africa, which was a dummy variable if an individual was educated in Africa, taking the value of one if they're from Africa and zero otherwise. So let's say we naively estimated the above regression. What would be the problem with estimating this above specification? There are likely a whole host of other variables which are contained within this error term u, which are correlated with Africa and are also important in determining an individual's level of IQ. So one particularly important variable is an individual's level or quality of education. So we can think about one of the big issues in Africa is that a lot of people just don't have access to the same level of education that we do here in the West or in the developed world. So we can think about there being some sort of correlation between education, which is contained in this error term, and our Africa dummy variable. So our Africa dummy variable takes on two values, a, zero, a value of zero if the individual isn't from Africa and a value one if they are from Africa. And we can think that the sort of spread of education levels in Africa is likely going to be centered around a lower average value than in developed countries. So there is likely going to be a negative correlation between an individual's level of education and whether they are from Africa. So the problem would be if we were to estimate this above specification by these squares, our estimate of beta which we would get out would more likely than not be biased. And in what direction would it be biased? It would likely overstate the effect of being from Africa. So perhaps the true effect on an individual's test score of being in Africa is actually zero. There's no genetic or any other sort of difference for an individual from Africa to do worse or better than an individual in the developed world. But because of the fact that we left out our important variable, education, our least squared estimator might in fact suggest that there is a sort of a 10 point decrease in an individual's average level of IQ if they're from Africa. So when you illustrate problems like this, it becomes quite clear why it is very important to ensure that you haven't got the issue of admitted variable bias in your regression specification. Because what it what it leads to is there being a covariance between the error term u and your independent variable, in this case Africa, which is not equal to zero. And because of that, OLS estimates will likely be biased. They will be wrong.